Hi guys and welcome back to Garage Tech. In this video we'll take a look how the dual clutch automatic transmission works. They are very much like a manual gearbox with a hydraulically controlled gear selection. You may have heard these being called DCT, DSG, S-Tronic or PDK. They all work with the same principle. As the name suggests you have two clutches. Common clutch types are a wet multi-plate clutch this has a number of small thin clutch plates which are cooled by an oil. On these types of clutch, the oil changes are really important. The other type is a twin dry clutch. These look similar to a traditional clutch with a pressure plate. And just like a normal manual gearbox, both clutch types do wear and will need replacing at some point. But the wet type clutch, if not launched too often, will last a lot longer. An important component is the mechatronics unit. This is the hydraulic activated solenoids which move the gear selector mechanism and engages the clutches. This is the most common part that tends to fail. The basic working principle is that clutch 1 controls the first input shaft which drives the odd gears 1st, 3rd, 5th and 7th while the second clutch drives the second input shaft with even gears. That's two, four, six, and then reverse. To keep the design as compact as possible, normally input shaft one fits inside input shaft two. Just to note, these two shafts work independently of each other and connect to their own clutch. The clever part, and which allows for those super fast gear changes, these transmissions can already pre-select the next gear. So when you're in first gear, second gear is already pre-selected. So when changing from first to second, the mechatronics simply disengages clutch one and engages clutch two. Now second gear is in use, the selector mechanism for gear three moves into position, ready to switch the clutch for gear three. This is how these dual clutch transmissions are able to achieve the super fast gear changes with minimal loss in speed. Okay guys, thanks for watching and as always, if you like these videos, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and put your comments below. Thanks for watching. Take care.